2024 presidential debate is set. President Biden and former President Trump agreeing to two dates, one in June and another in September. And it marks the earliest general election debate in modern history. Our D.C. Bureau Chief Ben Kennedy live at the White House with much more. Ben. Calvin, Nicole, this came together in a matter of hours today as Trump and Biden are set to square off in about six weeks in an effort to reach voters early. The stage is set for the first 2024 presidential debate after President Joe Biden posted a bold challenge to his Republican rival on social media. Donald Trump lost two debates to me in 2020. And since then, he hadn't shown up for debate. Now he's acting like he wants to debate me again. Well, make my day, pal. I'll even do it twice. So let's pick the dates, Donald. I hear you're free on Wednesdays. Trump was quick to take on Biden's challenge, writing on his true social site, it is my great honor to accept the CNN debate against crooked Joe Biden, the worst president in the history of the U.S., and a true threat to democracy. On June 27th, likewise, I accept the ABC News debate against crooked Joe on September 10th. You I certainly did. CNN's debate next month will take place in Atlanta, Georgia, and be one-on-one, -on -one, no third-party candidate. It will also not feature a studio audience. Just Biden and Trump facing questions from moderators. Gentlemen. It comes after the commander in chief announced that he would not participate in fall presidential debates sponsored by the nonpartisan commission that's organized them for more than three decades, pointing to issues with the way the commission has built debates as an entertainment spectacle and being unable or unwilling to enforce rules during the 2020 debates. And the reality here is that there are two candidates with a pathway to 270 electoral votes. That's President Joe Biden and that's Donald Trump, and the American people deserve to hear from them. Now, Trump also locked down a third debate in October on Fox News, but the Biden campaign did make clear they only agreed to two debates. Reporting live at the White House, Ben Kennedy, Local 10 News. Okay, Ben, thanks a lot. And now to our weather.